Namaste. Welcome to Divine Energy Tarot. I am Divine Energy. Welcome to my beautifully lit, abundant, and prosperous YouTube. If you enjoy it here, make sure you hit the subscription down below as well as the post notification so you're always alerted when I'm uploading to the channel and you don't miss out. Let's get into the messages. We have a message for Capricorn. At this time, Capricorn. What's good, everybody? I hope you're doing well. Wherever you are, okay. Let's get into Capricorn. Capricorn energy this week. Okay. Capricorn, you can feel some sort of emo emotional withdrawal from somebody. Maybe you feel like this person is a disruption or they make you feel sad or isolated when you're with them. They always hold on to what they have to say, like win, lose, draw. They be wrong sometimes, real wrong. Capricorn, this is about you believing in your magic right now this week. Okay, patience. Libra energy, balance. Okay, patience, balance. Okay, sustainability, joy this time. Okay, for Capricorn. So rejoice and celebrate. Okay. That's what I'm getting for Capricorn this week. Let's get some divine feminine and masculine messages for Capricorn this week. Let's get some messages from Venus. Let go of clinging. View your situation as a witness. Your inner strength grows. Okay. Ooh, Venus snapping on us, cat. What's good? Let's get the masculine messages from Mercury. Okay. Venus, snap, diggle, dizzy. Choose to leave the dark way for the way of light. Okay. For some of my Capricorns. Okay. Choose to leave the dark for the light this time. Cats. You already know. Take a moment to pause the video if you have to. Just so you can, you know, take a moment with uh Mercury and Venus messages from Buddha by feminine and masculine. Okay. Yes. Capricorn this week. Fear. Capricorn, realize you are testing your resolve to live in the energy of love. Fear. Okay. Teach yourself how to live in love. By facing your fears. Okay. Come on. Capricorn is sweet. Capricorn. Purpose. Okay. So I see our purpose for you this week, Capricorn. Okay. I'm big on the purpose for Capricorn this week. Purpose is going to be big. Capricorn knows what to do. Capricorn is here to do it purpose great fortune capricorn for you this week is popping out okay great fortune is popping out for you this week capricorn oh sudden wealth look at this something you're doing capricorn is bringing you some sort of abundance rejoice and celebrate i feel like it's because of all the things you've learned all the way up until now, you know, having that emotional withdrawal has allowed you to be honest and really see something from the perspective of reality. Maybe it was unrealistic with the way that you were seeing something in the past and now it's making more sense to you. Okay. Ooh, positivity going forward for Capricorn. Let's get another one for Capricorn. Lovers, okay. So there could be like, you know, somebody thinking about lovers or a lover at this time, okay. But again, maybe that person you feel like brings disruptions. Oh, masculine energy, okay, for Capricorn this week, okay. And this could also just mean for Capricorn, your more logical nature, your more logical side, right? Okay, and there being no easy way to this. For you Capricorn okay so don't try to cheat you know 
do it the right way. That's what they're saying. Tell me, give me one more for Capricorn this week. <clears throat> Believe in you, your magic. Okay, period. Because I feel like you're manifesting that love, you know, true love. But you're trying to get yourself stable, grounded, sustainability, right? Before you go after it again. I, I'm getting that big for my Capricorn this week. Boo boo. Let's get this uh, tarot messages for Capricorn this week. Capricorn. Okay. Hold on. Capricorn this week. Capricorn this week. Capricorn this week. We got out the Ten of Pentacles. So this week, there's a huge focus on money. There's a reward around it, is what they're saying. Your your legacy is just beginning, okay? Um, truly, landing in your purpose. It's still an open door. There's still many, you know, um, avenues you could take, okay? Don't feel rushed in that, okay? Queen of Pentacles, Okay? Because you, it's like you're always receiving some sort of help. You'll always be have guidance as long as you're being in this uh, positive energy of going from the dark into the light. Right? That's what they're saying for you. More balance. Right? It's bringing that change for you. Okay? Knight of Swords real quick. Okay? That's what's bringing it in fast for you. Tell me more for Capricorn this week. Capricorn this week. Capricorn. Okay, so we got out the uh, Six of Pentacles. So this week, there's going to be a focus on a lot of generosity, or maybe that's what helps you out this week for Capricorn. You know, receiving a lot of help or something like that. Okay, for Capricorn this week. Trying to fix the cards. Okay, this is Capricorn. This Six of Pentacles this is not more than just it's more than just generosity. It also talks of balance, you know, um, equal give and take. You're putting this out to the universe and receiving that back, you know. Meaning, like when they gave you that message, like no easy route, right? You taking um, that challenge seriously, you know. Okay. And that's what gives you kind of the reward flowing forward. Yeah, as it's 10 of wands falls out the deck. Okay. A release of burden. So go ahead and celebrate. Okay. Choose to leave the choosing to leave the dark from the, the light into the light is bringing you abundance. Okay. The magician. Okay. It's like you're getting your superpowers back. The magician is like you're gaining your superpowers back, right? Believing in your own self, believing your own magic all over again, right? And this is taking you to the space of you're no longer trapped. Actually, you feel more limitless these days, right? Cap Tell me more for Capricorn this week. Capricorn this week. Okay, that's a lot. Hold on. Let me put these in. Hold on. We got out 
Capricorn this week, you do have a fresh new start. So if there was something new you wanted to do, right, um, go ahead and celebrate because this is an opportunity. A lot of positivity going forward for Capricorn. All right. There's also here the judgment for Capricorn this week. Wow, Capricorn, your message froze. Um, with the judgment, you know, there's some sort of wake up, wake up call that um, leads you to be more mature and then in this more mature energy right for my capricorns um it leads to something very successful for some right um but first you have to embrace and be patient with yourself to kind of cultivate this right this new aspect of you okay because i feel like now you're being honest with yourself and looking at something like it was, again, just something unrealistic or that had you sad and isolated. And you was down with it, win or lose, you know, but it was totally a disruption in your life, okay? For my uh, Capricorns, all right? So this is facing your darker fears. And again, with this King of Cups, right? It's putting you closer to purpose, you know, by facing your fears, right? It's no foul in that no harm in that right Capricorn is realizing that they are testing their resolve to live in the energy of love Capricorn let's get some final messages it cut off I'm gonna see if it's it froze I'm gonna see if it records the rest of it I'm gonna just finish it for you Capricorn here with some final messages wow you got out the two of cups love keep coming out I'm telling you you see, you got the uh, swans. The swans represent true love, soulmate connections, okay? And I don't think it's this past person they're saying. King of Wands, it's a new person. It could be a possible fire sign, five of swords, okay? You could be mentally conflicted about it, the chariot. But you could be also making movement towards this. The star for Capricorn. When it comes to love this week, I feel like you're taking a chance on something here. Some of my Capricorns, that's for some of you guys. Not everybody's healed and ready to go there, right? Some of us are still dealing with, again, this emotional withdrawal, right? So take what resonates. Tell me more for Capricorn this week. <clears throat> final message is here. Damn, I thought that was the final message. I'm going to end it here. And then, uh, yeah, I love y'all. Bye.